that's it's even scarier. Kratos is scary daddy. Okay, there we there we go. You fucking fruit fly. Uh Elgato. Transform no full screen projection by main monitor. Okay. <clears throat> Yeah. Okay. Oh, it's splendid. Now. Aha, parried. Aha, parried. Ow. Aha, parried. Parried. Oh, okay. Al was impaired. That. Fuck. I don't even know what that did. Aha! Uh -huh. Secret Easter egg.
yeah, it, the tentacle is going to grab me down here. Oh, never mind. I had a loser. Ow. Get gate on. I actually prefer the OG God of War, the newer style. What you, uh, what you mean, James? Is this like the newer style? Oh, you're referring to like, uh, you're referring to uh, the, 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 uh, what is it? The 2018 God of War. Is that what you're referring to? Oh, okay, that's brutal as fuck. Because when you said, uh, the newer style is technically, like, this is newer, like, a lot newer than the original God of War by, like, six years. So that caught me kind of off guard. But yeah, I'm, I'm assuming you mean, like, the new God of Wars. Okay, yeah. I mean, I didn't hate, uh, the God of War 2018. I didn't hate it, um... I haven't played Ragnarok just because I don't own I that was bad time uh, but I can definitely see why uh, it feels a lot more like this feels more like okay we're gonna we're gonna fix that real quick I'm, I'm gonna have to like tape that button down okay there you go um What is it? Uh, yeah, I, I could definitely see why people don't really like it just because it doesn't play like a God of War. And even when you have the Blades of Chaos, it's like really slow paced. Like he he doesn't uh, like in this, he has like a whole bunch of like aerials. But in that God of War, he doesn't really launch up at all. Which the aerials really help with juggling. And this feels like more of like a hack and slash versus that one. It feels more of like a like this feels more like a um a devil may cry hack and slash kinda, and the newer ones feel more like um hmm what game would that be? Like a JRPG kind of hack. I mean, a Dante's Inferno, I believe, is JRPG. But you know what I mean. But yeah. 
a vestige. I don't know. They, uh, I kind of believe in what the one dude said who worked on the original team, where he was like, I didn't see the real point of, um, them making a new God of War. <laughs> like, I can, I can definitely get behind that, where it's like, you know, uh, the story was good where it was. Which I'm not saying they're doing a bad job. It's really good to see them continue it. But I feel like they could have, I don't know, done a little bit more before releasing a uh, Tempo Thanos got a death. Yeah, before releasing who who this is for. Yeah, before uh, releasing, you know, a brand new game, they should have remastered these, ported them all to like newer consoles, uh, remastered them to like at least 2K. 4k preferable just so people would enjoy it i don't even care i'd play it at 1080p as long as it ran on pc and looked decent <laughs> but I, I don't know I, I don't think we're gonna get that for a long time Which, to be fair, I don't think we're gonna get it at all, but, you know, having some hope in the, in Sony, uh, may do a little bit good. Is the, you know, they ported it to PC, so I think, like, the next major hurdle for them is porting, uh, Ragnarok to PC. And when that gets done, I think they're gonna take a little bit of a break between developments because I don't see them going straight into uh, God of War 3 well the game after Ragnarok I'm sorry but I could see them in between that releasing a remaster or like an upscaled version of just like so no I totally get you I'm kind of just uh, uh, tangenting my bad but yeah, no, I, I definitely see them, like, once they get Ragnarok ported, uh, switching it over to PC, like, getting it ported to PC. I definitely see them putting effort in at least scaling this, like, God of War 1, 2, and 3 up to the PS5. Because you can play it, but it's streaming. That's hilarious that that stream was in there, by the way. Um... But I'm not sure how far that's going to go with that said. I rolled into it. Because they may, like, do what they did on the PS3. Where, yeah, it's playable. But just fucking barely with, like, delay and whatnot. But if they do, like, a full remake, which I really hope they do. I don't know if you saw... But the, um, God of War Ragnarok had a DLC that showed, like, the original Kratos model. Like, in a higher resolution, scaled up or whatnot. So I was kind of hoping that was kind of like a, hey, yeah, man, we made the model. And, you know, it, it'll take forever to do, you know, all the environments and everything else. But they already have that model. So it feels like a waste to not utilize it, you know, in my opinion. But I can also get why they wouldn't want to just because, uh, one, this game has a lot of titty, which in the New York God of Wars, they don't have any titty, I don't believe. I wasn't exclusively playing uh, those games for titty, but, you know, this... They're gonna have to find a way to work around the city, because I newer, uh, I would say newer people are gonna get all up in arms, like, why are there so much titty in video games? Like, that shit that, that's been going on recently, where it's like, oh, why does this, why does this M-rated game have M-rated content? Why does this M-rated game sexualize... One, Kratos is fucking hot, in my opinion. But why does this game, uh, sexualize women? It's like, well, it's just breasts, bro. 
<laughs> I don't know. I, I totally get behind, like, you know, if it's, like, a teen-rated game, it doesn't really need to be there. But it's it's an M-rated game, you know? Like, add it, don't add it, who, who cares? But yeah, I definitely see them kind of pulling back snowflakes as usual. <laughs> Damn, snowflakes not winning titties in my stream! I don't think it's just that. I don't think it's snowflakes, like... Chalking it up to just all snowflakes. Like, I, I totally get it from their perspective of, like, you know, it it is, you know, just probably sexualizing in nature and kind of uh, annoying to always kind of just see that, but... I don't know. I think, like, the bigger issue is, like, why do you care so much about... Like, why do you... Why do they care so much about tits isn't tits like not a sexual thing i thought that was like a whole thing people were talking about where like uh tits shouldn't be like sexualized so it's not sexualizing if it's not a sexual body part anyway back re retracking back to uh, what i was saying i don't know i would really hope that they would eventually port this forward Especially the PSP games, because I know that you can play them on the PS3, but that means your only two options is the PSP and the PS3, which neither make it look the best. Like, obviously, the PS3 is going to look progressively better than the PSP version just because hardware, but uh, I don't know. Like, even with like the better hardware it uh it still doesn't look the best just because it was a psp made game and they didn't put too much effort like upscaling it or anything like that like they put as much effort as uh, okay thank you uh joystick for stick drifting on me again they put as much effort as uh okay i'm gonna write that down on my ps I have a sheet of things that I have to buy and fix and whatnot. <sighs> Google Doc. Yeah, let's just go to my resume. And go to... Modification notes. Uh, I'm going to throw at the very bottom. PSP things to fix. The battery that I have to buy is this one. 3.3... 025 uh, battery block replacement voltage and amps. Then look up and replace PSP stick as it has stick drift. I have a PSP 3000 and one god of edition red and black there we go okay okay i have a, a list of everything that i want to do with my psp and my ps2s and whatnot <laughs> so yeah my psp is really bad stick drift and i bought a, a replacement one Replaced it, which took fucking forever. I never added the metal bar back into it because I was like, fuck that. But, um... Yeah, it's just so fucking annoying. Because the PSP is so hard to get into. And so I'm gonna buy the replacement stick and the, um... Replacement battery so I could do that shit right next to one another. Without having to do it, uh, like multiple times. Which the replacement battery is such a pain in the ass. But yeah, digressing. Yeah, I really hope that they uh, they remake these games because this uh, specifically Ghost of Sparta really kind of goes more uh, dwelling in Kratos's past. Thank you, Sick Drift. Okay, can I? No.
But if you want to know the uh, the timeline of events, oh, it goes God of War one. Kratos. Uh. Is this? No, it doesn't. I, I I'm wrong. No, my son. It goes um. It is me. Ascension. Chain of Memories. God of War one. And I'm sorry. Ascension. Chain of Memories. This goes to Sparta. God of War one. God of War two. God of War 3, I think, and that's the order. I may be wrong. We do not have much time, Kratos. Your ah. brother does not have much time. Excuse me. I remember reading online, people were shitting on Ascensions. Like, God of War Ascensions, and I can't get that shit. Like, God of War Ascensions wasn't terrible, in my opinion. But I haven't not played it since it came out. I'm sorry. I had no choice but to lie. You must listen now. The Temple of Ares in Sparta holds a secret that will lead to your brother. The road will not be easy, but you must help him. You must, Kratos. <coughs> he needs you. This cannot be. You know, for a Why? PSP game, Why would you do this? this looks really good. Your father forbid me to tell My you. father? Who is my father? By the way, this is his mom. Just so we're, uh... Ah! Okay. Okay, again. Bro, that was a hell of a hit. Okay, that was just me being dumb. Damn, that was a delayed hit. I'm sorry, Mama. I didn't mean to make you cry, but tonight I'm cleaning up. <laughs> Finally, I am free. Finally, 
Your brother, Kratos. Go to Sparta. Find Demos. He needs you. Mother! What have I done? With her last breath, she released the weight of her burden and finally found the peace she had long sought. But for Kratos, the rage was almost palpable. Fate had once again pushed him to the brink of madness. Kratos. Alistos armlet. His mom was Callisto? Yeah, you got my favorite move. Ooh, they made it even more broken than this. Come on, game. Come on, game. You just killed one of them, you jackass. Ah, we don't need the... <laughs> it... I am the of this 
Damn, damn spiders. Hey, uh, work sore. How are you doing, bud? How you doing? I'm doing pretty good. How are you doing? Your morning's going, uh, good? If it's morning for you? As it's 8 a.m. for me? This really does feel like God of War 2. Like, they got the God of War 2 feel down for this. Even though I, uh, I've yet to play God of War 2, so I'm just basing off of... <laughs> Assumption. Because <laughs> God of War 3 felt more cinematic than I uh, care for, I off of memory. Eek. That hurt. Oh, that actually really hurt. It's sleeping for me. I'm doing dry to drive like 150 miles just now. What the fuck? You. Why? What happened? It's 3 p.m. for you. You're in Europe. Is there even like 150 miles to drive in Europe? I guess that's like corner of Britain to the other corner of Britain, right? Path is blocked. Okay. I'll take the health click. Whee! I like how they simplified the uh, save menu. Like on the PSP. Okay, gotta find the gear. I went to some big ten to experience play to me. That's what I can call it. Huh. I mean as long as you had fun. Seems like it would be fun. My stick fucking made me go the other way. My PSP is really bad stick, Drew. <laughs> Thera. Hey Thera. How's your uh mommy milkers doing? I mean, yeah, flight simulations are really fun, especially if it's like those, uh, the, is it like the NASA training ones that they have, or the, like, Navy training ones they have? I have not come here for you or your kind. Do not be so naive, Kratos. Your path led you to me. You need my help. I need nothing from you. If you do not free me, then you will share my fate. You will die here with me. But to be honest, the experience of driving like 100 miles per hour with free open ceiling. My power will be yours. Without it, we will both remain huh. prisoners of our torments. Oh, I mean, if you're driving 100, you got there an hour and a half. I will be going now. Alright, well, thanks for stopping in, uh, Buckstar. I appreciate it.
I would say this is like one of the coolest enemies in God of War. Oh, that's all I have to do it, okay. Ow. 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 Come on. Yeah, cut that shit off. Wham! We're really doing this just to be assholes like we had no like we had a reason but we are just being assholes right now Please stick drift.
That might kill me. Just barely alive. Now Feather might actually just be an eyeball. Minotaur and Horn. Minotaur, Minotaur. Mini, 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 tower, mini, mini. No. It's really weird. I'm pretty sure this takes place before God of War 1 ends, but it looks like he has like the Athena blades. Which he gets in God of War 1. So I feel like this may not take place right after God of War. Right before God of War 1. But it makes sense that it does. But it doesn't make sense that he has the Athena blades on his back. Maybe that's just how they look. I don't know. I messed up that. Gorgonai. Woo! 
Uga. Hey, Big Iris. How you doing, bud? Ooh, got lucky. Whee! Imagine having the upper good as always. So you're doing pretty good. Uh, I went to the Walmarts this morning to get uh some like trash bags or whatever. So I decided to get a uh a sandwich. Not a sandwich, uh, a salad from Walmart. So it wasn't too bad. Uh, it's definitely Walmart unseasoned chicken, though. They could have at least put, like, some fucking effort into seizing it. But outside of that, pretty good, pretty good. Uh, I'm making... Ooh. Ow. Ouchie. No. Oh, yep. That's gonna... Okay, we're fine. Alright, we're fine. Um... Yeah, um, I made a list, a very important list of things that I'm going to do to the PS2 Slim, just so I know how much money it's going to cost in total. So, uh, and then I have to fix a few things on my PSP, which isn't fun, but, uh, they have to be done. I have to fix the stick drift because the stick drift's really bad. And then the internal battery had died, so it's not keeping track of time. Which is a minor inconvenience, but I'd like to get it fixed at least. Because this is the uh, original PSP I had as a kid, so I'm going to try my best to take care of it. Uh... But yeah, that's, that's how my day's going. I don't know if you were in here whenever I went on, like, the long tangent about the PS2 stuff that I'm doing. If you'd want to hear about it. If you were, then I'm not gonna... Dude, I found a PS2. I'm gonna take it, I'm gonna work perfectly fine. You dumpster dive? Dude, I wish. Around here, like, people get antsy if you, uh, you dumpster dive. I had to get a new PSP and my old one died. I got lucky, my... I wasn't here. Okay, I really want to know how do I get to that chest right there. Anyway, um... I'll take a second and I can show you. I just realized it's in my car. Well, fuck. Um. Yeah, you, I'm. Yeah, I was just gonna hold it up, and be like, "Yeah, this is it." Um, I have a PS2 Fat that I'm not gonna fuck with because I just like the Fat model by itself, and I'm gonna keep it like at least one kind of normal. And I'll um. Let me see. If I... There we go, okay. And then, just to make it a little bit more... That. There we go. Okay. This is uh, as best as we're getting. Okay. So, there's a YouTube video by Zach Builds of him modernizing a PS2. Which, um... He uses a fat model instead of a slim, however, he uses a very similar power structure needed for the PS2 slim. Okay, replaces thermal pads, pads, and clock battery. My clock battery is perfectly fine on my PS2 slim, but I think it's still good to replace it, in my opinion, just because uh, it's, it's fucking old, so it's going to die at some point, so might as well do it now. Replace this fan. Have to find a good replacement myself. This model is used for the PS2 Fat. I think I found a good one for that. 
they do sell PS2 Slim bands on eBay, but I'm looking for like a um a ball bearing one or like a motor like a uh winchless one so it doesn't make noise. So because the PS2 one it just has a it's a really old shitty one. These are the Fernal pads he recommended. They're the uh, Altry 100x 100x millimeter efficient conductive resistant ones. The power supply notes. This is the big thing that uh needs uh I need to like really look into, which I, I kind of did. So the power supply on a PS2 Slim and a PS2 Fat is completely different. If you have a PS2 Fat, no, okay, that it uses this cable, right? Where it's just the cable, no brick, and it's straight wall adapter. Well, a PS2, that's for the PS2 Fat. Uh, let's be more specific. That's for the PS2 Fat. As on the inside, it has its own converter to do the whole converter stuff. Well, PS2 Slim, all of that is done inside that power brick that comes with it. So I want to convert that power brick into being a type C cable, which is like what your cell phone, like my cell phone type C cable. And they're pretty modern. And that's what I want to convert the PS2 to, which you need a USB PD chip that supports 12 or 20 volts. Uh, I see a lot of people do 20 volts because you need uh, the right amperage, but a lot of different places say different amperages. Some of them say 3.5, some say 4.5, and some of them say 5.5 amps. But if you get a bucket uh, dump, which is like a bucket converter, which converts it from 20 volts down to 8 volts, but 5 amps, uh, I, th that's another thing. So I have two, I have a YouTube video, but it's in Spanish about that. And then this printables link where, uh, it has like a link to the stuff that that person used to do it. And then for my PSP, the battery clock died. So it uses a 3.3 volt, uh, two F. I don't know what that is. I think that's amps. So I have to buy that and that's not too expensive. And then I have to look up to fix the stick drift. But yeah, that's the, uh, that's the plan. I also just realized I wrote slime instead of slim. Things, yeah, so that's what I want to do. And then, uh, you weren't here, so I can look it up for you. PS2 HDMI. Mod, mod, PS2 HD, and mod. Uh, they sell uh, these PS2 Retro Gem, Retro Gem Universal HDMI upscaler kits for PS2 Fat, PS2 Slim, PS1, and X6, N64. So if you do PS2 Slim, and then do a shiny model, and then optional spare cable. Oh my god, it's two hundred four dollars. And then the basic's one hundred and thirty four. But the difference is the basic goes up to seven twenty p. Uh, the retro gem. Hang on, I'll just uh display so I can show you. There we go. And then we'll do that. Okay. Uh, this is it. It adds an HDMI port right here. Uh, it takes soldering, it has this cable, and then this one, and then a whole bunch of other minor cables. Uh, and it looks like that. This is the HDMI, that's the board, that's the HDMI cables. So that's the, uh, that's the board, that's on the back. I wish that they had a photo of it wrapping around the... Uh... Anyway, yeah, so the difference is direct mode, which is just direct capture, 480p, 720p, 1080p, 
and 1440. The regular retro gem doesn't do 1080 and 4040p. The retro gem shiny does. The neither have a D interlacer, which is bad. <laughs> you would think you would have a D interlacer. Oh no, that's the. Uh, I'm sorry, that's this. So it has a Bob deal in the laser. Only the Retro Gem Shiny has a Weave. And then Retro Gem Shiny has the Motive. The Scaler, they have Integer and then Free and Custom. They have basic scan lines, adaptive, and slot mask. So uh, it is really expensive at $204. That's if you don't get the spare cable. The spare cable is this one where it's like this. Uh, that's why it's so expensive because it is a bigger cable but it is like 25 bucks or whatever um i wish they had the photo of how to install it Yeah, I have a 7,000. I think I have this model. I think I have this model or this model. If I have this model, I'm going to be pissed. Uh, I wrote it down. I just don't, uh, I don't have it uh, up. Document. Index. Okay, there we go. PS2 Slim. So, kit includes PS2 Slim Main Flex, Slim Roller, and Audio Flex, Intermediate Flex, HDMI Mount, Plastic Mount Mini, Flip HDMI Adapter, One Screw, Two Nuts, Two Screws, Two Screws, and Two Nuts. Items to try are temper controller soldering iron. I have that. Leaded solder. I have that. Non corrosive, non clean flux. No clean flux. I'm gonna ha I think I have that. I don't know if mine's no clean. Isopropyl gloves. I have. I have a multimeter. I think. Solder braid desoldering tools. I have that. Small Phillips screwdriver. I have that. And copped on tape. I do not have copped on tape. So I might need. That's the yellow tape, huh? Yeah, I'm I need to buy that. Understanding the gem kit and setting up the gem jumpers to use on configure. That's gonna suck if I have to do that. Which, to be fair, in mine, I was going to uh, just do it in this uh, he does, where he just fucking cuts out the heat sink and puts it on top of it and keeps the metal bit off, which is what I wanted it kind of do. But yeah, uh, it's like a whole fucking like, list of shit you have to do. The control. Yeah, so those two in there. So it kind of goes like that. That's not too bad. That's only four soldering points. That's not too bad. And then that's three soldering points, which is also not that bad. I'm spawning this bit of. Look, okay, that's not bad. That's one solder cable. This is like where it gets really bad because uh Yeah, there you go. Uh you're soldering one, okay, let's count it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven pins. One, two, so all of these pins, and then eight pins here. 
and then it looks like these solder into these two. So it looks like how many pins is that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And this is micro soldering. So you got to think that like this is the scale. So you're we're working with really don't want to bridge any of these gaps. Don't want to do any of that. And that's where it's really hard. Which they could have at least cleaned this fucking board up, you know? Like, look at how dirty that board is. Anyway. Hey, Ali. How's it, uh, how's it going? Okay, let's go back. And then the main flex, yeah. And then testing. So, yeah. But that's the fan I'm gonna replace. So yeah, I wanted to do this, but that takes micro soldering, and I'm gonna fuck that up. I'll trigger right trigger D pad right. Oh, okay. Anyway, what are you looking at? Uh, we're looking at the documentation for the uh, Retro Gym Universal HDMI Upscaler Kit for the PS2 that costs two hundred and four dollars that I want to get eventually. Because this also says if I really wanted, it says that I can upgrade. Uh, what is it? It says I can upgrade this. Retro Gem Shiny update. So I can do that where I can upgrade it. So I may just buy the, uh, the basic and then upgrade it to the shiny. Because it's only like 70 bucks. But I'd rather start with the basic. Micro soldering easy. Micro soldering not easy. Micro soldering definitely not easy. Rotated bottom side. What does that look like? Oh my god. That looks fucking terrible. Oh, I wasn't- I- I was only focusing on here. There's also these these points that you have to solder and right there must be a skill issue i i'm not good at soldering it is a, it is in fact a skill issue and then you have to do that cable ali if you want to do it you fucking can Oh, I would not want to have to do this where you have to remove, like, stuff. So I'm going to have to check what board I have. Because this is based off of what, huh? It says at the top. Too boring. Okay, well, we're about to get off of me looking at this. I, I, I was trying to find that page that explained... Uh, everything, and I couldn't find it until just then, whenever I was scrolling through. <laughs> anyway, yeah, back to the game. We really just kill innocent motherfuckers for fun.
But yeah, uh, big, that's what I want to do. But, uh, you know, I thought it would be a lot easier. <laughs> I want to be real. So that might be like something I look into. But like, uh, like, of course, something I look into, but something that I, uh, spend a little bit more time kind of getting prepared for because that's a lot of soldering hey Oscar how you doing bud okay fuck you there we go Oh, so you can really tell that they made God of War 2 right before making this. Fucking switch, goddamn switch. There we go. Honestly, I'll just be happy if we can get, like, it scaled up to at least, like, 720p without issue on the PS2. Like, I don't even care if it looks 1080p as long as it just looks, like, normal. I don't know if I could use it for speedrunning, though. I feel like saying, like, yeah, my PS2 is just hella fucking modded. Yep, I get it. Okay, thank you. Oh my god, that's hilarious. Fuck. There we go. The fucking tag team. Okay. Oh, look, another boss fight. I think that's the horn. Yeah, that's the Minotaur horn. Minotaur, Minotaur, Minotaur. Feather. Oh, you can't set him on fire. Okay. Whee! How many? One, two, three, 
four, five, six. We're already halfway through on the uh, the powers. I don't think we're close to the end, like halfway through. By being halfway on the powers is kind of a uh, oof. -a. Look, it's Athena. Okay, let's look. Athena, you lied to me. The gods lied to me. My brother. Hey guys, I uh. He lives. I don't want to dox my name. Here, I'll just pull up the uh purchase. I purchased a broken PS2 controller because I want to learn how to solder the cables effectively. Which it looks like there's only one broken spot, which is really good because I'm not looking for length. So I may just be able to cut that cable where that spot is because it only looks about eight inches on a eight, man, not eight inches, like a foot on a eight foot wire. So it's not too bad. But they, I paid eleven fifty eight for it. Shipping six dollars. I paid five dollars for the broken controller because I offered them five bucks. Like it was a bid thing, and I was like, I don't think this person's gonna be like getting anything more than like three dollars. So I was like, shit, I'll bid like Athena's out. Same with these. Would it be the game? Do you be able to use this? Can I shove it up my ass? Anyway, um. So if I actually can get that controller working, I'm gonna send a photo to the uh, the person who sold it to me and be like, "Hey, I fixed your controller. Like, you're not getting it back, but I fixed your controller." <laughs> we already know your name. What's my name, Ali? Like the people on Discord know my name, but they know my first name. I meant like my full fucking name and address, Ali. <laughs> That's what I meant. There are very few people on the internet uh, who knew my phone name. Johnny. Well, yes, Ali, my name is Johnny. But you don't know my full... First and last name is a uh, imperative. Like I was hiding my mailing address. <laughs> Which I mean, my cell phone was like bright, so it's not like you're gonna see it. I just realized I didn't sign in to mix it up. Cause I was like, man, uh, fucking zombie's not here. Hang on. I gotta wait for Mix It Up to sign in. There we go. Uh, my favorite bot's in, ASMR Mayu. Thank you, ASMR Mayu. It sucks. Okay, Allie, can you, you can, you can talk now and it'll update. Anyway. Um. Or I could pay you... I really want to donate to the stream. <laughs> I mean... I can't really stop you doing that, right? Like, you can, in fact, go onto uh, my Twitch stream. Donate one cent and then find my last name. But I still haven't gotten donations to actually work on PayPal yet, which is annoying. Which I might just replace the fucking link with- no, I can't do that, that's my last name. Because, like, the whole thing is it counts it as a payment and not a- like, you sending me money as a friend. 
Because if it did that, then it, I wouldn't have an issue, but I have to link, because it's a payment, I have to link it, or whatever. Which, I mean, the, the fucking one person in the last couple of years I've streamed has ever donated, so... I don't think it's imperative I fix it anytime soon. I might do like one of those wish list things on like Amazon where it lets you purchase me the item without uh, you knowing who you sent it to. I think that would be really, uh, that would be beneficial to me. That is pure asshole right there. Kratos is a motherfucker for doing that. Honestly, seeing Kratos is like a fucking death sentence. Like, even if you're like an innocent bystander, just seeing this motherfucker is like an instant death sentence. Okay, fuck. How's your day going? I didn't think I asked. You know what I find really funny? Is that I had this set up to do the other camera that I had gotten for Christmas. And then I just like took it down one time and then never reset it up and then just never uh, re like just fucking left it. So I might get that set back up just so we have a better camera. I don't know, I need to buy, like, I guess, like, the only reason I really had issues is because I was lazy. And didn't buy the, uh, the extension that I wanted to buy for it. Where it, uh, it just took wall adapter. Hello Kitty Ah uh, headphones. Yes, they are Hello Kitty Ah uh, headphones. Specifically the licensed Hello Kitty headphones.
Ow. Oh, I gotta yank that bitch's head off. Okay. There we go. I will say in Chain of Memories, where you don't have to button mash to cut her head off, it was a lot better in my opinion. Here, Serbian. Yeah, this is the, the full headphones. They have, like, the, the ear at the top. Oh, it says Hello Kitty. There you go. And then now the, the inside of it, it is all the kitties, but it got messed up whenever I uh, dyed my hair. We've won the battle. Hold fast. <coughs> God damn. What happened here? We have angered them. The gods. They sent a message to all who defy their glory. But we, we survived. Spared us. She, she. Who spared you? The daughter. A message to the ghost of Sparta. <coughs> the labor begins. <coughs> Death awaits the ghost. <coughs> he will never. Get the skull. The skull.
God damn birds. There we go. This isn't going to be fun doing this walk with stick drift. Phoenix. Didn't work.
Named after Hercules, the city of Ecmelon is the capital of Crete and the main trading city of Atlantis. Oh, that's cool. It did it crash down while frozen and die? That's hilarious. Increased final damage, increased regeneration, improved a searing core. Increased damage, increased regeneration, arc lightning. Yeah. Let's try the eye of the lamp. Man, fuck. That was an accident. Oh my god. Okay. Fuck. Okay. Pro.
Так. I have no reason to buy this. I actually think for the first time in a hot minute, I go on it. Go pee. Save. We'll get to the next save mark. And I am going to go use the bathroom. Oh. fool of all, Kratos. The ghost of Sparta. The slayer of Ares. And now, the destroyer of Atlantis. The slayer of Ares? That means this is after God of War 2. What the fuck? kingdom will not bode well on Olympus. I care little for the gods. And yet you walk beside them. I did not ask for the throne of Ares. You were given the honor to walk among the gods, and yet you spit on it like it was dirt. The gods can keep their honor. I wish only to find my brother. Ah, yes, the other one. <laughs> Try if you must, but you will not succeed. You will never find him. And in the wake of your destruction, you have sunk the only path to your salvation. This is all that awaits you at the end of your journey. Not before I find Demos. Be wise, my son, and turn back now. Do not seek the domain of death. <laughs> Fight right here, please be a fight. Wahoo!
And it's funny, I said I had to pee, then I don't have to pee no more. Horn, but uh, if I get another Gorgon set before like anything else, I'm gonna be fucking seized. These again? What the fuck? Damn.
Yes, Kratos. Bro, what?
I'm stuck.
You know, I feel like in later games, the difficulty definitely, like, got thwarted. Because I, f like, God of War 1 on hard, like, normal, I guess it, it's called or whatever, uh, was fucking brutal. Hey, uh, <laughs> Jesus loves Kit Kats. How are you doing? <laughs> That's a really solid name. And then your photo is Penguin Z. It's, uh, <laughs> it's a great mix there going on for you. 
Oh, okay. So he just didn't grab on originally. Okay, I actually want to drop down. You can call me Kit Kats if that's fine. Alright, no, you, you're good. <laughs> How are you doing, Kit Kats? Can I drop the fuck down? No, okay. There's an Easter egg and I can't get back to it. Let me, okay. Once you dedicate coming up here, you're up here. That was a massive bird. How's your day going, Kit Kats? I don't know if I just asked that, my... I am... Uh, dumb. God. It has so many birds. That's what I want in my God of War video game, birds. Oh, I got... Low quality anti in scale. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it definitely 1980s. I'm definitely not playing this on the PSP. <laughs> uh, the game definitely didn't come out in 2010. Come here, bird. There we go. Okay, I. There you go, die. That one, the, the archer right in front of me didn't die. I fell down. That archer just shot the archer in the back. Oh, there you go. You would think that in like 2010, they're like, hey, maybe this person saw it and wanted to backtrack before fucking you over. And making it so you can't get it. Nope. Yep, okay. Perfect. That's exactly what I wanted to do. This better not be like before that fight. I'm going to see the... Okay. Holy... What the talk about was that wrath of God? Huh? The what? The this spin? That's uh the fire because on this you can make your blades fire like that. And then you can do the cyclone, which is in all the games where he spins in a circle. Oh, perfect. Ow. So the gimmick of this uh, God of War is just uh, you have the Cyclone ba Blades. That's like on blades. He has the fire ability because it's supposed to be like death is like you have to travel through the ice dimension or whatever, make the ice worlds and whatnot. And so like a lot of the enemies have armor that you need to break. That's only I died. The uh, enemies that have armor that only the fire uh, ability can do. Because they were really trying to go for a, like a third bar mechanic. Barely got out of that one. A third bar mechanic, so like, you know, health, magic, or whatever. So they wanted something that would give him uh, another bar. So they're like, oh yeah, the fire makes sense. Perfect. Oh, 
Wow. Ow. Ow. Okay, we're alive. Oh, we got it killed and solid. But yeah, uh, not I wouldn't say every call God, every God of War has a gimmick because not all of them do. But the gimmick in this one is just that, like some things need you to use the fire ability because it is on the PlayStation Vita, so they had to justify the Vita for whatever reason. Okay. You hit me from that far away is fucking crazy. That dude hit me from like a mile away on a left swing. I think we're going for right here, right? No, we're going for uh, over here. Okay, grab the box. Yeah, my PlayStation, uh, my P PlayStation Portable has stick drifts. So, uh,. It's partially pain in the ass. There we go. Yeah, okay. Get on the wall. There you go. Like this dude. He's only uh, armor. Which I, I think I said it uh, earlier, but I think out of like a lot of the God of War enemies, the Automaton is like one of my more favorite ones. Just because like, um, it's very unique in the sense that there's not a lot of enemies that give you a quest item natively and you have to like find them, but also they like... They're not overly hard, but not overly easy, because on harder difficulties, they get like a little bit of a pain in the ass.
pé. Didn't seem like we took a lot of damage or any major damage at all there. All this way for a red chest, wow. Eleven hundred, fuck. Erinus, the daughter of Thanatos, the god of death. Pain given form, evil given life. Ghost of Sparta, the god slays. Your brother belongs to Thanatos. So, so. You cannot stop me. Nothing can. Club men. Oh, I remember this being a hard fucking fight.
Yeah, that's that's death. She spawns that in right in you. Moo. She spawns that shit right when you're in her. Like, she breaks the parry. Like right there, how am I? I can't. She spawned that while I'm in her. Like, bruh, I can't do anything if she spawns shit. Like the birds, I, I'm blocking and the birds are hitting me.
No, I'm like... Okay. Oh, bro, I was rubbing my fucking ear. Okay. Okay, I have gotten tired.
So are we going to bed? Not bed, but just not streaming. So I hope you guys. Night.